In the pulsating heart of Cyberpunk 2077's Night City, where neon lights cast shadows as deep as the myths of old, a legend stirs to life. Enter the saga of the Thundering Berserker, a warrior not just of this age, but of an era when gods walked among men. This modern-day champion channels the ancient fury of Norse gods, his fists crackling with the unleashed power of thunder, a force that turns the urban chaos into a stage for epic battles. The journey of the Thundering Berserker is a tale where mythology and machinery intertwine. V's arms, now augmented with state-of-the-art electric gorilla arm technology, are not mere limbs but the mighty hammers of Thor himself. Each strike resonates with the force of a thousand storms, echoing the ancient wrath and valor of Norse battlegrounds. The berserk operating system, woven into the very fibers of this warrior, awakens an untamed fury, bestowing upon him a state of heightened battle prowess, making him nearly invincible in the crucible of close combat. As you step into the whirlwind of this electrifying odyssey, you embody the thundering berserker, where the spirit of Viking warfare is reborn amidst a tempest of cybernetic enhancements. In this realm, each clash is a chorus of thunder, each victory a legend in the making. Unleash the fury of your storm, let your might echo through the canyons of steel and glass in Night City. The thundering berserker does not merely fight, he rewrites the annals of time and technology with each thunderous blow. Join this saga, where ancient myths and cybernetic dreams collide, and become the storm that reshapes the world of Cyberpunk 2077. Welcome back, Chooms, to our immersive build series in Cyberpunk 2077. Today, we dive deeper into the storm with the thundering Berserker build. Our journey in Night City transcends mere stats and gear. It's a crafting of legend, where each element of our build contributes to an overarching narrative of power and myth. In this episode, we delve into the specifics of the thundering Berserker. We'll explore how V's transformation into a figure of Norse legend is realized through carefully selected perks and cyberware. From the devastating might of electrically charged gorilla arms to the strategic advantages offered by the Berserk operating system, we break down how each component integrates to form a build that is not only potent in combat, but also resonant with the echoes of ancient thunder. For those captivated by this journey into a realm where fantasy and futuristic warfare intertwine, consider subscribing. Your support enables us to push the boundaries of character creation in Cyberpunk 2077, crafting unique and captivating gameplay experiences. The time has come to step into the role of the Thundering Berserker. As you embark on this path, you'll transform Night City into a battleground of elemental force and awe-inspiring power. Forge your path, embrace the fury of the storm, and leave a legacy that resonates through the streets of Night City. Your saga as the Thundering Berserker begins now. May your journey be as epic as the legends of old. In the sprawling urban expanse of Night City, where power is measured by chrome and circuitry, V's story took an unexpected turn. Once a mercenary navigating the underbelly of a city fueled by greed and cyber enhancements, V's life was a relentless pursuit of the next job, the next edge in a world where humanity was increasingly optional. Everything changed the night V stumbled into the clinic of a Ripperdoc, known for radical cybernetic enhancements. This Ripperdoc, fascinated by the ancient Norse myths, had developed a series of experimental implants inspired by the legendary Berserkers warriors, who according to legend, channeled the primal forces of nature into unbridled fury on the battlefield. Intrigued and desperate for a new edge, V underwent a series of risky cybernetic procedures. The result was transformative. V's limbs were augmented with cutting-edge technology, allowing them to channel electrical energy like the furious strikes of Thor's hammer. But more than the physical change, the surgery unlocked something primal within V. The Ripperdoc had implanted a neural stimulator that could induce a berserk state, granting V immense strength and resilience, reminiscent of the storm gods of old. Now, as the thundering berserker, V roams the streets of Night City, a force of nature in human form. Each clash with the city's myriad dangers is a dance of electric fury, V's cybernetically charged fists delivering justice with the raw power of a tempest. No longer just another mercenary in the neon jungle, 
The thundering berserker has become a symbol of raw, unbridled power tempered by a human heart. Yet this transformation has come with its own burdens. V struggles with the duality of their nature, the human spirit grappling with the unleashed fury of the storm. The path forward is fraught with conflict, both external and internal, as V seeks to reconcile the human and the mythic, the mercenary and the warrior of legend. As the thundering berserker, your journey begins here. Will you harness the storm within to become a legend in Night City, or will the fury consume you? The streets whisper tales of your exploits, but the future is yet unwritten. Step into this world and forge your path, a path of electric might and ancient fury. Rising from the echoes of ancient lore, V's fashion as the thundering berserker is a striking testament to the melding of primal myth and future shock. His chosen hairstyle with shaved sideburns flowing into dreadlocks and braids is more than a style. It's a homage to the warriors of old, a cascade of Norse tradition woven into each strand. The Nordic tribal tattoos etched on his skin are silent pacts with the old gods, symbols of an unyielding spirit bound by the runes of yore. Clad in a cutting-edge ensemble, V stands as a modern-day embodiment of Thor, a colossus on Night City's battlefields. His chest piece, a bulletproof vest of the highest order, is akin to the mythical armor of the Aesir, crafted not just for protection but to instill awe. The dark tones of his armor, interspersed with striking blue accents, are not mere fashion statements. They are the colors of a stormy sky, mirroring the electric fury he commands. The robust exoskeleton pants enveloping his legs are not mere garments, but the very essence of his thunderous advance, allowing him to charge with the ferocity of a wild tempest. Every step is an echo of thunder, every leap a lightning strike. The blue tubes adorning his arms, pulsing with energy, are not just ornamental. They are the conduits of his power, the heralds of the storm, signaling the onset of his electrifying assault. This attire transcends the mere aesthetics of war. It is the uniform of a force of nature, a declaration of a warrior who rides the gale of battle. It's a mantle for those who dare to harness the heart of the storm, to engage in the relentless warfare that thrums through the veins of Night City. Detailed in the description below are the specifics of these fashion pieces, each item a component in the armor of a legend. Wear this attire, embody the essence of the thundering berserker, and let your presence in Night City be as commanding and fearsome as the roar of a tempest unleashed. In the arsenal of the Thundering Berserker, the art of war is redefined with a focus on blunt weaponry, a testament to the raw, unbridled power of a storm-made flesh. This build, steeped in the traditions of ancient warriors, harnesses the full might of blunt weapon perks available in Night City. Each strike is not just an attack, it's a display of crowd control and stunning force, resonating with the ferocity of a tempest. The heart of this armory beats with the electrifying gorilla arms more than mere weapons, they are extensions of the Berserker's own will, pulsating with voltaic energy. Each punch delivered is a thunderclap, an embodiment of relentless fury. These cybernetic limbs serve not only as instruments of destruction, but as the core of the thundering berserker's combat philosophy, offering myriad ways to control and stun the enemy, dominating the front lines with raw power. Complementing these formidable arms are two devastating weapons chosen for their synergy with the build's theme. First, the Tinkerbell, an electric baton that buzzes with the potential to incapacitate, its current strong enough to stun the most resilient foes. Then, their Sasquatch's hammer, a monumental maul that turns each swing into an event akin to a meteor's impact. These weapons are not just tools for inflicting damage, they are conduits for crowd control, leaving enemies staggered and vulnerable under their stunning might. Integral to this melee-centric approach is the Berserk operating system Cyberware. It elevates our Berserker to a state of near invulnerability, turning them into an unstoppable force amidst the chaos of combat. This system binds us to the raw intimacy of melee combat, enhancing our presence on the battlefield. For scenarios demanding a long-range touch, we keep firearms as a secondary option, 
a means to draw distant foes into our storm of melee combat. In this build, ranged weapons are the last resort, our primary focus remaining the visceral thrill of close quarters combat. Smoke grenades form a crucial part of our tactical arsenal, not just as tools of war, but as elements of strategy. They provide cover, create chaos, and bolster our defenses, allowing us to engage enemies at close range, weaving through the battlefield like a specter of war. In this selection of armaments, the thundering berserker emerges as a legend made flesh. Every weapon, every choice, contributes to the narrative of a warrior who harnesses cybernetic mastery and primal rage to subjugate foes. In the hands of the thundering berserker, each blow is not just a strike, but a saga of power and control, etched in the annals of Night City. In the legend of the Thundering Berserker, a titan among warriors in Cyberpunk 2077's Night City, our path is carved with a mastery of attributes that echo the might of ancient gods. We channel the force of Thor, maxing out in three attributes, body, reflexes and technical ability, shaping a berserker that could stride through Jotunheim unscathed. The remaining essence of our warrior's soul is infused into cool, sharpening the edge of our critical strikes, as lightning sharp as Mjolnir's crack. The body attribute is our anvil of war, where we forge the weapon mastery of our guerrilla arms. These are not mere tools of battle, but extensions of our primal rage. The right branch of this tree is like the roots of Yggdrasil, deep and unyielding, transforming our every punch into a saga written in the annals of Valhalla. Here, we unlock the wrecking ball mechanic embodying the unstoppable force of a raging storm giant. We become the harbinger of chaos, our sprint a thunderous charge that scatters enemies like chaff in the wind. Amidst this whirlwind of fury, the quake mechanic is our call to the heavens. With each leap and ground-shattering slam, we summon the wrath of the gods, our foes cast asunder by the seismic might of our descent. Each quake is a tale of the old gods, a demonstration of raw power that scales with the height of our leap, a true storm lord's descent upon the battlefield. But the thundering berserker is more than a force of destruction, he is a spectacle of gory artistry. The finisher mechanics are the verses of our war song, a symphony of electrifying finishes that resonate with the gory finesse of a true warrior. With the might of Thor's own fury, we execute our foes, turning them into projectiles, a meat missile that wreaks havoc amidst the enemy lines. Yet, in the heart of battle, survival is as crucial as the strike of the hammer. In the middle tree of the body attribute, we find our shield wall, the adrenaline rush. This is our berserker's safeguard, a temporary shield that surges with each health potion, enveloping us in a bulwark of vitality. Surrounding perks are the runes of survival, enhancing our durability and granting us the swiftness and resilience of the Aesir themselves. Our Berserker's saga is not complete without pain to gain, the cycle of destruction and restoration. With each enemy felled, the cooldown of our health items diminishes, fueling our rampage with the relentless vigor of a warrior in the throes of Berserker Gang. This cycle perpetuates our unyielding resilience and fury, a testament to the ancient spirit that drives us. In this build, the Thundering Berserker is not just a character, he is a myth reborn, a fusion of cybernetic strength and the raw, unbridled power of the storm. With every thunderous strike and seismic shock, we etch our name in the chronicles of Night City, a warrior god in a land of neon and shadow. In the realm of reflexes, the thundering berserker finds his stride, each step a dance of the warrior. This attribute is our battleground for mobility, echoing the swift and elusive movements of the Nordic gods. Here we unlock the essence of our melee warrior's agility, enabling us to move like lightning across the battlefield, a force as untouchable as it is destructive. The first of our mechanics, Slippery, is the embodiment of the wind's grace. The faster we move, the more elusive we become, a shadow darting through the fray, untouchable as the northern lights. This major perk is bolstered by minor enhancements, extending our slide distance and vaulting prowess turning every movement into a tactical advantage. While we forego the perks that enhance gunplay, such as reloading while in motion, our focus remains unswayed. The melee, the clash of might and metal. The dash mechanic is our strike of Thor's hammer, 
our movement akin to the rumble of distant thunder. We become a storm unleashed upon Night City, our dashes like bolts of lightning, closing gaps with the speed of thought. Minor perks further empower this ability, weaving in increased mitigation as we dash and restoring our stamina upon each enemy felled in our whirlwind advance. Our dashes are not mere repositioning, they are strategic strikes, each step a thunderclap heralding our approach. Air Dash, the third mechanic, is our leap into Valhalla's skies. We dash through the air with the weightlessness of the storm, our agility in mid-flight enhanced by perks that grant us even greater maneuverability and mid-air mitigation. We are not bound by the earth. We are as fluid and untamable as the winds of Jotunheim. Lastly, the legendary Tailwind perk is the heartbeat of our berserker. It is not just a skill. It is our lifeline, ensuring that our stamina, the fuel of our relentless assault, is ever replenished. Each dash and air dash not only avoids stamina depletion but actively restores it, a cycle as perpetual as the storms we embody. This is crucial, for our blunt weapons, the tools of our wrath, demand a warrior of endless vigor. With these skills, the thundering berserker transforms into a tempest of strategy and fury. Each dash and leap is a tactical strike, our presence on the battlefield a storm of war. Our mobility is more than movement, it's the essence of our berserker spirit. As we navigate Night City, we embody the unpredictability of a thunderstorm, our actions resonating with the power of ancient myths. The reflexes a tribute thus becomes our narrative, with every lightning-fast move a rekindling of Norse legends in Cyberpunk 2077's neon reality. As the saga of the thundering berserker unfolds, we turn to the technical ability attribute, where ancient Norse ferocity meets the pinnacle of cybernetic innovation. Here, in the steel and circuitry of Night City, our berserker becomes more than a myth. They transform into a cyber viking, a futuristic echo of legendary warriors. Our journey through technical ability begins with the All Things Cyber Perk, a core of our cybernetic enhancement. This is akin to donning the enchanted armor of the gods, each piece imbued with the power to enhance our cyberware, making our berserker not just formidable but nigh unstoppable. The reduced capacity cost for equipping advanced cyberware is like gaining favor from the gods, allowing us to wield even mightier tools of war. Surrounding this central perk are minor enhancements that fortify our defenses and amplify the capabilities of our cybernetic arsenal. The additional stat modifiers are akin to the runes of old, each one adding a layer of electrical fury or bolstering our resilience in the heat of battle. Alongside these, Optional quality of life improvements provide added versatility. They enable us to gather more components from fallen enemies, enriching our arsenal and resource pool. Additionally, they offer enhanced options for cyberware customization, allowing us to tailor our enhancements to fit our specific combat style, particularly focusing on the relentless enhancement of electric damage over time. The license to Chrome Perk then becomes the Berserker's Battle Hymn, a song of steel and fury. It not only boosts our cyberware stats further, but also reinforces our armor, turning our body into a bulwark against any who dare stand in our path. The additional skeleton cyberware slot is like gaining the bones of Jormungandr, each piece a layer of unyielding protection. The reduced cooldown and extended duration of our cyberware perks mean our berserk mode, a state of near invulnerability, is unleashed with greater frequency and potency. This is crucial for our frontline berserker, who thrives in the heart of combat, fearless and unflinching. Completing our array of enhancements, the Edge Runner perk embodies the Berserker's wrathful descent into cyberpsychosis. As each enemy falls before us, our Berserker's rage grows, blurring the lines between man and myth. This state of increased damage, a dance on the edge of madness, is a testament to our willingness to sacrifice everything for unparalleled power. Each kill extends our frenzied state driving us deeper into a cyber-viking rampage, laying waste to gangs and foes across Night City. Venturing into the left side of the technical ability tree, we delve into a realm where each choice further owns the Berserker's lethal capabilities. This side of the tree is where the nuances of combat strategy come alive, transforming consumables into vital assets on the battlefield. Here, each perk and enhancement is not just a tool, but a weapon in its own right. 
fine-tuning our berserker for the unique challenges of Night City's urban warfare. In the depths of this domain lies the Glutton for War perk, a testament to the berserker's unyielding endurance. This perk reduces the cooldown of health items by 5% with every enemy defeated, echoing the relentless vitality of ancient warriors. Coupled with the legendary Pain to Gain perk from the body attribute mentioned earlier, which further decreases health item cooldown, the synergy is unmistakable. Minor perks in this vicinity enhance the potency and recharge rate of health items, turning each potion into a draft of the gods, fortifying us in the heat of battle. Next, we encounter Health Freak, a major perk that quickens the recharge speed and charge of grenades and health items. This is akin to harnessing the speed of Sleipner, Odin's steed, ensuring that our berserker is always ready to unleash fury. Surrounding minor perks refine this prowess, enabling faster use of health items in combat, augmenting grenade capabilities, and ensuring even quicker health item recharge at critical moments. The Pyromania perk is where our Berserker's fury meets the primal element of fire. This perk not only accelerates consumable recharge rate, but also grants us a burst of speed and increased explosion damage after dealing or receiving explosive damage. Our electrifying gorilla arms, as well as the shock and awe cyberware, capable of shock damage, become conduits of Thor's lightning, triggering the pyromania effect. The minor perks surrounding this further enhance the potency of the buff, fortifying our defenses and offering more avenues to generate this electrifying state of war. Lastly, the legendary Ticking Time Bomb perk stands as a pinnacle of our destructive capabilities. When activated, it releases a powerful electric EMP during the use of our berserk cyberware, stunning enemies and adding another layer of crowd control. This turns our berserker into a walking storm, each step a potential catalyst for chaos. While navigating the left side of the technical ability tree, we strategically sidestep certain perks that do not align with our build's focus. We pass by perks aimed at reducing self-inflicted explosive damage for additional pyromania stacks, or those enhancing projectile launch, as these do not complement our melee-centric approach. Instead, we embrace the Flash Sail perk, which doubles the charge and recharge speed of our smoke grenades. This choice is crucial, as it enables us to envelop the battlefield in a strategic haze, creating openings to strike with the cunning of Loki and the strength of Thor. Each punch we land carries the power of a tempest, reinforcing our dominion in close quarters combat. Our journey through the left side of the technical ability tree culminates in a transformation of the Thundering Berserker. No longer just a combatant in the urban jungle of Night City, our Berserker emerges as a legend reborn, where ancient myths and cutting-edge warfare coalesce into an indomitable force. As we continue to forge the saga of our Thundering Berserker, our focus sharpens on the pivotal role of relic skills. Far from mere enhancements, these skills are the keystones in unlocking the warrior's full thunderous potential. Central to this arsenal are the Gorilla Arms relic skills. When fully charged, they allow us to unleash devastating shockwaves, echoing the fury of Thor's hammer, knocking down enemies within range and adding a seismic dimension to our battlefield control. Yet it's not just brute force that defines our berserker. The strategic incorporation of the vulnerability analytics relic brings a cunning edge to our onslaught. This skill, although challenging in a melee-focused build, offers a significant advantage. When we strike the highlighted vulnerability on an enemy, it triggers an area of effect electric explosion. This synergy of precision and power further elevates our thundering berserker, marrying the raw ferocity of ancient warriors with the finesse of modern technology. In every encounter, these relic skills transform our engagements into displays of mythic power and cybernetic precision. The Thundering Berserker stands as a paragon of this dual nature, not merely a fighter, but a legend reborn amidst Night City's neon and chrome. In the saga of the Thundering Berserker, our embodiment in the cybernetic realm is not just about power. It's a resurrection of Norse myth in the heart of Night City. The cyberware we choose is akin to the armaments of the gods, each piece a testament to the might of a Viking warrior reimagined in a neon-soaked future. The frontal cortex is our mental forge, where strategy meets the fury of battle. The axolotl cyberware here is like Odin's wisdom, reducing the cooldown of our other cyber enhancements with each fallen foe, 
synergizing with our berserk cyberware and blood pump health cyberware. It's as if every enemy we vanquish fuels our rage and resilience. The mechatronic core turns us into a bane of machines. Our electric gauntlets become Mjolnir, smashing through the armored shells of drones and robots as if they were made of mere paper. And in slots where the cyberware of battle does not fit, we choose the self-ice, a shield against digital trickery, enhancing the defenses of our cyber viking. Our arms, equipped with electrifying gorilla arms, are not mere limbs but the very thunder of Thor. With every punch, we unleash a storm, each brutal finisher a spectacle of ancient warfare reborn. In our skeleton, the framework of our might, we embed the epimorphic skeleton and bionic joints, granting us a fortitude that echoes the unbreakable skin of the Jotun. Rara Avis, enhancing our armor further, makes us as formidable as the dragons of Norse legend. Our nervous system is tuned for battle. The adrenaline converter surges us with speed akin to Sleipner's gallop, while Neofiber weaves a web of protection, fortifying us against blows. The reflex tuner is our last stand, a magical slowing of time akin to the gods' intervention when we are on the brink of defeat. The integumentary system, our shield and sword, is crowned with shock and awe. In the heat of melee, it releases bursts of electric fury, turning our very presence into a weapon. Proxy shield and pain deucer transform pain into power, making us a juggernaut in the midst of chaos. The heart of our cybernetic enhancements is the Berserk operating system. In its activation, we become a literal embodiment of the Berserker of old, a cybernetic manifestation of ancient fury. It's as if the spirit of a Viking Berserker has been reborn, granting us a temporary state of invincibility where we meet our foes with primal force, our melee attacks amplified in a symphony of destruction. Our face, adorned with Kiroshi clairvoyant optics, becomes akin to the all-seeing eyes of Heimdall, piercing through the smoke of battle to identify our prey. In the midst of chaos, while our enemies are blinded, we see with the clarity of a hunter, striking with lethal precision. The hands of our berserker, though lacking specialized melee cyberware, are marked with a tattoo that completes our cybernetic ensemble, ensuring we utilize every advantage offered by the gods of technology. In our circulatory system, the adrenaline booster rejuvenates us with the stamina of the Einherjar, with every foe felled by our hands. The blood pump, echoing the resilience of the Aesir, acts as a stronger counterpart to mundane health potions, its efficacy magnified by our chosen perks. Micro-rotors in our system enhance the speed of our strikes, turning each blow into a whirlwind of fury. Our legs, fortified with reinforced tendons, empower us to leap towards our adversaries, descending upon them like Thor from the skies, our approach heralding the quake of battle. This cyberware, this modern-day armor of the gods, transforms us into more than a mere combatant in Night City streets. We become a living myth, a fusion of the ancient and the future, each piece of technology a reimagining of the Norse legends. The thundering berserker with each step and every strike writes a new saga in the annals of Night City, a saga of thunderous might and unyielding spirit, a testament to the power of myths reborn in the age of cybernetics. In Night City's neon sprawl, the thundering berserker's saga is legend, where Norse myth meets cybernetic force, reshaping combat into an art as grand as ancient epics. Behold the berserker, a tempest of olden rage in a new world order. With gorilla arms crackling with voltage and the shock and awe cyberware turning each stride into a storm, enemies crumble like kindling in Thor's wake. Stealthy as a gust, our warrior descends amidst smoke grenades, enemies toppling unseen in the orchestrated chaos. The berserk operating system ignites, morphing us into divine avatars of wrath, while the axolotl implant spins cooldowns into oblivion, crafting a warrior transcending mortality. Our tale, from Night City's shadows to mythic heights, is not just a character build, it's the forging of a legend. In this saga we don't play, we become the thundering berserker, where every clash and tactic writes a new chapter in Night City's chronicles. Join the Odyssey, and leave your mark as the saga of the thundering berserker thunders across Night City, a symphony of myth and machinery that echoes into the digital eternity, and that's a wrap on another episode of our Cyberpunk 2077 journey. 
Thank you all for tuning in. Your feedback and ideas for future builds are invaluable, so please keep them coming in the comments. I'm thrilled by the support and enthusiasm you've shown for the series. While we're deeply rooted in the streets of Night City, I've also been exploring some other incredible worlds in gaming. Starfield's vast universe, the daunting challenges of Diablo 4, and the captivating stories of Witcher 3 have caught my attention at the moment. I'm thinking of expanding our horizons and bringing you builds and content from these games as well. Let me know if you'd be interested in embarking on these new adventures together. Your input will help shape the direction we take as we explore these additional gaming realms. For those who wish to support the channel further, please check out the description for ways to contribute. Your super thanks are greatly appreciated, as they help sustain the channel and bring more of the content you love. Plus, we've got some exciting news. Our membership program is now live. Join the Fang Nation and become part of our vibrant community. We offer three tiers, Scout, Vanguard and Sovereign, each with its own unique perks for those who want to get more involved and support the channel. Your support, in whatever form it takes, is the backbone of our community, enabling us to dive deeper into the worlds of gaming together. So let's keep pushing the boundaries, exploring new territories in gaming while continuing to revel in the cyberpunk universe. Until next time, continue to channel the fury and might of the thundering berserker in your own epic quests. Embrace each challenge as a storm to be conquered, showcasing the strength and strategy of a true warrior of Night City. I'll see you in the next episode, where we'll delve deeper into the legends and continue our relentless conquest across virtual battlegrounds. Farewell for now, Tunes, until we meet again in our next thunderous adventure.